Guys, big boldy trail. We're gonna go ahead and attempt this one. We already did the Buena Vista. Not recommended you do both on the same day. Uh, we got some, you know, time. So, might as well get some steps in. Uh, here's the trail. There's a Buena Vista. We did that one. Uh, I guess we're doing trails of Sequoia Park or something there. Sequoia Forest. Anyway, guys, so here's the big boldy. Uh, I didn't say a mile marker, so I'm not sure exactly how many miles. But anyway, we're going to track through this and see how it looks. There's the view. It's kind of foggy, smoky today, so, you know. And snowy. I don't like hiking when there's snow and wet ground. But we'll see how far we can get before we got to head back because I'm not a fan of snow and wet hiking thing. Okay, guys, with the trail behind us, well, not behind us, we're in the rocky area, the flat area is behind us. It's cooler, but a lot of smoke. And they're doing a control burn and there's a fire or something going on. And man, not a pretty day to hike with so much smoke. At least not for me. It's up there. So Buena Vista was like 1.3. It says one on the trail. This map, I think it was one, two, one, three, something like that. This particular one is 2.2. So as I said, if we do one a day, much better. We're attempting two of them in the same day. So it's a little more difficult. Okay, folks. The rest of the journey continues. So we climbed through some dirt, some rocky areas. Now it's kind of like, sort of kind of meadow, flat, up, down, your left, right, you know, so it's not bad. As I said, only reason coming here is avoid the people, avoid the cars, smog, get your lungs some fresh air, get your steps in, get some exercise. You know, it's nice to just get away from the city. So here we are. Tracked pretty nicely, right? All the way, then all of a sudden it's just getting super snow and wet. I don't know. I'm gonna try to go through this patch of snow. If it's just still wet, I'm gonna turn around. I don't wanna get my shoes dirty and wet and all that. You know, we gotta hike back and we gotta hike in the sit in the car and stuff. And this is not the type of hike I normally do. <laughs> We're gonna attempt it a little bit, see where it goes. And we'll make another call up there. So there's a lot of snow. Uh, sorry, no GPS or anything, so I can't tell you exactly where I am or how many, how many miles, but it's a big boldy trail. I still say the little boldy was better, but yeah, something different. You should try all of them. They're not really hard trails. You know, just I wouldn't attempt two in a day. It just seems like a bit much what we're trying to do today. Uh, one trail a day, much better. Here we are. Made it pretty high up. This marker, see the red spot over there? Some kind of marker, it doesn't have a number on this one. I'm assuming it's 11, because we passed 10 way back. So if you look in some sides where the sun doesn't hit too much, right? Mounts of snow. On that side, well, not too much light, but there's enough, enough snow. Then you go this direction, sun hits, and then you don't have any snow. But I went from like freezing cold to like, like super hot area here. Okay guys, so here's the video. There's snow right there. My three quarters ways up, right? One mile and a half, I'm thinking. Not too far to go. If you keep going, you'll hit the top. But this is kind of a view here. I'm gonna rotate this way. I'm gonna take a little break. And it's kind of getting late and cool, you know, cold weather. But, you know, another 25, 30 minutes. You can make it all the way top, and the top is right there. You can see the peak right there. There might be snow up there and stuff, and the rocks are really slippery once you get all that high. So I'm just going to go ahead and bag it, take a break, and we'll come back and finish this video next time. I think I uploaded my old video when we were there last summer, so that might be still in play. If it's not, what I'll do is I'll re-upload that video. Because we've been through all these trails, right? We're doing it again. So every year we go through the same, you know, eight trails down here. 
and then this year hopefully we'll be able to make it to Yosemite if we can get a ticket because now it's ticketing system who can enter who can't and all that good stuff because there's just too many tourists going through just to look at the falls but I mean, they don't realize this kind of couple of falls so when one fall on this trail two falls if we just keep following the 180 down there's one by three rivers there's another fall over here uh, hiking trail by the big campground I forgot the name of that campground there's a general store and stuff and there's uh, three four different trails it's by one of the lakes over there so uh, we did that one and you know it's not that bad of a trail you can still look at the waterfall not gonna be as good and big as the Yosemite by any means but, you know something different so there's the Boldy it's basically the trail continues I don't know if you can make out the trail between the trees right there so it just continues right there and you end up on that peak and that is the big boldy anyway guys signing off don't think we'll do any video going back get some snacks water hopefully we'll spot you know a couple of more animals so far we've seen some birds chipmunks uh, either a beaver or a very giant squirrel or some kind of <laughs> rodent looking animal uh, very friendly yellow color but not sure what it was don't forget to subscribe thumbs up i'm still trying to reach the million marks i don't think i'll ever reach it there but heck eventually i'm just gonna have to say if i can't reach it i quit and stop making these thing videos so let's see if we can get me there guys come on thumbs up this thing guys went on back trail coming back so one of the good news is the air you know a little breeze came by uh, kind of took away most of the smoke at least I don't see fog because the weather, you know, warmed up. So all we have to is really smoke left, no fog. So you can do a pretty good view. The side is kind of decent up the hill over here. We're going to go down that trail, came through here. You know, it's kind of a view, right? It was a better view up there, but it's really blocked. We couldn't see much. But, you know, them, all the destruction from the fire last time is still here. Hopefully the trees, you know, they'll start replanting because they really need to do something. It doesn't look too good. Anyway, guys, still on Big Boldy, heading back.